keep it good from Birchbox, so contouring is one of my favorite tricks to help my face look just a little more sculpted and defined. And contrary to popular belief, it's a lot easier than you would think. Here's some tips. So start by picking either a bronzer or a foundation that's two shades darker than your skin tone. I used to be a fan of using a bronzer, but the Visanti liquid cover-up is great because the applicator brush makes it really easy to apply the contour. And what's also great about it is that it has a super matte and sheer finish to it. So let's get started. Suck in your cheeks slightly and draw a line under your cheekbones parallel to your jawline. Because I have a round face, I also apply a contour line under my jawline and chin. To make your nose look a little longer and thinner, apply the liquid cover-up on the sides of your nose. Now the next step is key, blending. Using a tightly bristled angled brush and short strokes, blend the color upward towards your hairline and then blend under your jawline. Use your fingers to blend the sides of your nose. Now for the fun part, highlighting. This is how you're gonna get that Hollywood glow that everyone wants. Apply highlighter under your brows, on your cupid's bow, and on your chin. I'm obsessed with this skin illuminator from Make. Again, blending is super important here. A stipple brush will blend the highlighter without losing the luminizing effect. Finish off the look with a blush on the apples of your cheeks. Make sure you smile. So this is how I do contouring, but I know everyone does it just a little different. So let us know in the comments below how you do contouring. Thanks for watching.